Hey guys, it's me, Cassie, and I'm back with another YouTube video. We're just gonna be doing packing orders and stuff like that. My business went viral on TikTok a few days ago, so when I did have my restock, everything sold out. Right now, I only have like two pairs of lashes in stock and like some lip gloss sets, but like all of my popular individual glasses are basically sold out so we had a sold out restock and that's crazy because all my goals for this year was to have a successful restock and to me 50 plus orders is successful because if you know where i came from to where i am now it's like you guys don't understand like the amount of prayer and like the amount of everything i've done to like get my business where it is now when i tell you guys i stand by tiktok like TikTok is what you need to be on if you have a business. If you want to have a successful business in 2021, you need to be on TikTok. I know people before it used to be Instagram, but Instagram is like you can get followers, yes, but it's like most of your followers aren't gonna buy anything. That's just how I feel about Instagram. My TikTok followers support, like my Instagram followers, like I have 24 point something K, but my pictures still don't get thousands of likes but on tiktok i can get thousands of likes on a video and it's like i don't even i don't know what, what it is with instagram it's like i never bought any of my followers all of my followers i grew them myself but it's like whenever i post it's like they're not there like it's weird but tiktok when you post your followers will see it the for you page will see it. like all like everyone's gonna see it that's why i love to talk more than i love instagram like i love my instagram page yes but nothing beats tiktok in my opinion like if you want Successful business, TikTok is where you need to be. Let me just say that now. So, where's my laptop? So, I'm, I actually need to print out orders. I have 56 orders, I believe. But I'm not shipping the ones that I got today because I need to make the lip gloss for those. Like, I know I told you guys in the last video that when I had a restock, that I was going to make all of my glosses before the restock. That did not happen. As much as I would have wanted it to happen, it didn't happen. So... We still have to make glosses, but all the orders from the restock, those glosses are made except two shades, I believe, which is fairy dust and crystal. Those are the only two shades I didn't make before I did my restock. So yeah, let's print out these labels real quick and then we can start shipping orders. I think I'm gonna have to take my um, shopping cart or wagon to the post office because i only have two mailing buckets and it's not going to be enough to hold all the orders and i don't even think i have enough bubble mailers to be honest so i don't know what i'm going to do because i bought 250 from uline but i've shipped so much stuff since then like uh, i literally have like 30 right here i think so yeah but let's start shipping these orders and oh and don't forget to follow my second business Instagram and Noya's skin. We're bringing our body butters back. Our facial oils, all stuff like that will be sold on the skincare page. Is this in order? Okay, look how expensive shipping labels are. 50 labels is $159. And this is all priority, no, not priority. This is all first class mail. And look how much it costs. Like that's a lot. This is my first, my most expensive shipping batch. Cause I never, I never shipped 50 orders at one time. Like I always shipped like 25, 25, 25. I never did 50 before. So look at me reaching new, new goals, new achievements. But yeah, let's watch these labels come out this machine real quick. I don't even know if I have enough labels. Oh yeah, this is the thing from UPS I was talking about. The 7,000 shipping labels you can get for free, y'all. 7,000 for free. Okay, vloggy vlog. Excuse how messy this place looks, y'all. These are tubes and just packaging everywhere. Like, it's not trash, I promise you. There are literally lip gloss tubes in there. I just keep the boxes so that I, when I'm ready to trash, like all this packaging stuff, it goes in the box instead of like having trash bags everywhere. But y'all, yeah, we're done printing out labels. We have four orders left, but those orders were placed this week. So they're not shipping yet. And I have not made those lip glosses yet. So that's, 
that's why but i'm about to take a picture of all this and then we can get into the packaging station. okay guys so i set up a mini packaging station and i have most of the best selling glosses out the rest of the glosses are in this bucket but i put most of the ones that people order out on the table so they're easier to reach to i have bow mailers this is not all of them this is just the stack i've picked up for now and those are the all the packing slips and stuff like that I have a few lash orders right here and yeah let's let's get this on the road Okay, so this first order, I can show y'all on the top of all their information. The first order is a lash order, actually. And I'm going to try to fit it in one of these bubble mailers because, guys, I barely have any boxes left. So like, everything's just going to have to fit. So she ordered London Fairy and Kiss Me. And then she got a mink ink or liquid eyeliner so yeah we're just going to start off by putting first we're going to close the lashes lashes and then the liquid eyeliner I'm just gonna squish it up up there and then we're gonna um get the packing slip put that in there as well and make sure it's the right person just like that and then we're gonna put some confetti at the top just so it's cute when she opens it and also our business card squeeze that in there And stick. And we're gonna put the packing slip on it. Not the packing slip. The shipping label, and that's it. so it's the next day and i did pack orders i got through mm, i'll say like 35 percent and while i was packing orders i realized that there's more glosses that i actually didn't make so now i have a stack of orders that i didn't complete because i didn't have the lip gloss that they ordered 
So now I'm back to making more lip glosses. And now another one of my TikToks are currently going viral. Thank you, Jesus. So I'm getting more orders and my lip glosses are all sold out now, like for real, for real. So I'm, about to, I'm ordering more tubes tonight. I plan to have my next restock in the beginning of August, hopefully. I want to start having two restocks a month, but it's actually a lot harder than it sounds because like when you make all that gloss and then you restock, it's kind of hard to just go around, go back and purchase more glosses if you don't see how the restock is going, like if that makes sense. Like I can't just restock my glosses and then order more right away because I have to know like which glosses people are buying, which glosses aren't selling, stuff like that. Like for me, in my last two vlogs, I think, I told you that I made a gloss that I didn't like. Y'all, the gloss I made that I didn't like was the first gloss I sold out. Boba Mango Nada, that gloss was ugly. Like, I did not like how it looked like. In my imagination, I imagined it to come out looking a completely different color. And it didn't come out the color I wanted it to come out. And then it sold out. And I'm just like, wow. Excuse me, my water bottle, so I drink a lot of water at night. So I was just like, wow, the gloss I didn't even like is a gloss that's selling like crazy. Excuse my lace, y'all. I was at church and I just drove home and I was hot, so it's lifting. But, oh, well. But yeah, like the gloss, I didn't expect to sell the gloss that sold the most. So it's like really crazy. So now I'm ordering double of those tubes this time. So then I can make more of that gloss since it's like going crazy now. So yeah, wish me luck. I'm so tired. Literally, sorry for how the camera looks. The sun is right there. So it's making it look blurry. Guys, I just packed all these orders. That bucket over there. And then this stack of orders, magically, the lip glosses that I need for the order, I don't have. So now I'm really like, I'm so mad because I thought I was done. I was like, oh my God, I'm about to go to the post office and be done and find out that I'm not done. Like, I'm so, y'all, the next piece talk, I put my hand on the Bible. I am making all the glosses before, before I do a restart because I need to be able to pack orders and be done. Not pack orders, make gloss, pack orders, make gloss. Like, no, I need to have all of my glosses made before my next restart. Like, I cannot, I can't keep doing this to myself. Like. So angry. I literally made this gloss and this wasn't even one of the orders. Like I'm tired. These are all the ones I just did right now. Some of these are heavy. There's more on the floor. And that bucket's already full. So I don't even know where to put these. So that's why they're on the floor right here for now. But I'll come back when I'm done with everything. Okay, vlog. I finished packaging all the orders now. And now I'm about to figure out how to get all this in my trunk and be off to the post office. Okay, so all orders have been shipped. I just want to say thank you to everyone that has supported my business. Like, none of this would be possible without God, number one, and you guys for actually supporting. Like, it means the world to me. You guys do not understand. So right now, I'm about to go to Chipotle because it wouldn't be a real day in my life if I didn't eat Chipotle. And I'm also going to go to Target and look for furniture again. I'm not including that in this video. It's just going to be another video when I'm shopping again. But yeah, thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and tell me what you want to see on my channel. And I'll definitely bring it to you guys. And yeah, love you guys. Peace.